Out of the chaos of the battle and the earliest days of a new regime, a chance for some justice for WPC Yvonne Fletcher. The fledgling administration in Tripoli is believed to know where Matuk Mohamed Matuk is. He's the only named suspect still alive who could now be charged with her killing. Downing Street confirmed they were working with the new National Transitional Council and getting ready to send police officers to Libya to investigate. It still requires some sensitive diplomacy, but Britain's also helping the new regime by backing UN plans to unfreeze nearly a billion pounds worth of Libyan banknotes currently in this country. The funds will be used for urgent humanitarian aid, but also to pay public servant salaries. Many people haven't been paid for months. We must act quickly and decisively to meet the considerable challenges ahead. The humanitarian situation in Libya demands urgent action. Rebels, meanwhile, are preparing to take Sirte, the last loyalist stronghold, and have given pro-Gaddafi forces until Saturday to surrender before force is used.